Hi folks, this is Jay. Hope you're okay today. It's good to see you. We're looking at the Word of God in your life. And I uh, hope that it's an encouragement to you. Like I said, if you want to know God, you've got to be willing uh, to study the Word of God diligently. If you turn to Acts chapter 8. Acts chapter 8. Verse 26. Acts 8.26 And the angel of the Lord spoke unto Philip, saying, Arise, and go toward the south unto the way that goeth down from Jerusalem unto Gaza, which is a desert. And he arose and went, and behold, a man of an Ethiopian eunuch of great authority, under Candace called Queen of the Ethiopians, who had the charge of all her treasure, and had come to Jerusalem for to worship, was returning and sitting in his chariot, red Isaiah the prophet then the spirit said unto Philip go near and join thyself into the chariot to the chariot and Philip ran thither to him and heard him read the prophet Isaiah and said understandest thou that thou readest and he said how can I except some man should guide me and he desired Philip that he would come up and sit with him the place of the scriptures which he read was this he was led as a sheep to the slaughter, like a sheep lamb dumb before his shearers, so opened he not his mouth. In his humiliation his judgment was taken away, and who shall declare his generation, for his life is taken from the earth? And the eunuch answered and Philip and said, I pray thee of whom speaketh the prophet this, of himself or some other man? And Philip opened his mouth and began at the same scripture and preached unto him Jesus and they went on their way they came unto a certain water and the eunuch said see here is water that doth hinder us to be baptized and then Philip baptized him so the eunuch the Ethiopian eunuch was on the chariot and he was reading the book of Isaiah and as he was reading God sent Philip and expounded it to him but if you're not searching, if you're not listening to the preaching, if you're not studying the Word of God, you'll never come to salvation or you'll never grow in your salvation. Okay? 